Hey guys, um, I'm not sure exactly how you want me to do this video, but I tried to squeeze everything into the picture. Um, it's probably a little hard to see, but here is the um, Bossy Audio K2. Um, I'm running it with a Mac Mini, and uh, I can also run it with my iPad here. Um, everything is um, getting sourced. Um, through either the iPad or the uh, Mac Mini. Um, I can run it uh, straight out of my audio uh, 3.5 jack for my Mac Mini. And I've got my two channels, no problem. I can run um, Bluetooth, everything out of the Mac Mini, no problem. It's all, got all the channels. I use it for my uh, music. All the USB connections work. It's brand new. It's an M1 Mac Mini. Um, okay, so what the issue is here is, let's see. Um, so the Fossey Audio unit um, has Bluetooth, um, optical, and USB. And um, let's fire up the optical. So for optical, what uh, the signal route is, is it's coming out of my Mac Mini uh, via HDMI to this Toshiba TV. It's going out of uh, optical output from the back of this Toshiba TV um, straight into the Fosse Audio. So if I go up here and select Toshiba TV, uh, we're gonna route our sound through that and then I go to my Fosse audio unit and I pick optical by clicking the little selector button and there we've got music. Works great. The optical input. Um, the optical input works great. Um, so I'll turn it up a little bit and I'll pan back and forth so you can see both channels are working fine. It's just a balance. Over there. Over here. Over there. Over here. Alright, back to the middle. Both channels. Alright. So, let's try Bluetooth. So we click our cells over to Bluetooth. Now we're running Bluetooth out of this iPad. Um, and we push play. And there we have music. What do we got for volume? A little more. Oops, that's down. There we go, up. Alright, so once again, if we adjust our balance, we have our left channel, we have our right channel, left channel, right channel, and back to the middle. Alright, and here's the part that doesn't work. So, we're going to click on over to USB. And to go to USB, we hit go up to our uh, USB host interface port, USB connection. And there it is. So, got a right channel here. I turn the balance and nothing is coming out of the left channel. I know that the Fosse audio unit is sending both channels to my receiver because all the other uh, sources work. Right channel, we have music. Left channel, nothing. Alright, so hopefully that explains the issue. Um, you know, I, I, I have a, another USB. This is a brand new USB cord. Um, let's um, pause it. We'll shut this off. We'll plug in this USB cord, just so we can I can prove it. Uh, it's not the cord, and it's in a different USB port too. So different cord, different USB port. Turn our power back on. 
Um, and let's see what we got here. Balance, no left channel. Right channel. Left channel. Right channel. Still doesn't work. All right, so hopefully that video explains it. Um, if you want anything, let's uh, do a quick close up. That's the unit, brand new, all connected, USB in, line out, uh, Bluetooth antenna, the Bluetooth works great, the optical works great. We can click over to optical. There's optical, red light, and if we select optical on the computer, now where are we? Uh, there's optical on the computer. Oh, and there we go. We've got volume in both channels. All right, so optical works, Bluetooth works. I don't have anything connected to the, uh, what do you call it, the coaxial input, but uh, so I don't know if that works or not. But I'm, anyway, the USB does not work. Okay, thanks guys.